All right, TTC, it's Sunsnero 6 here, and I was hoping it wouldn't come to this, but it has. It is crow time. My first crow video. So, yeah, first things first, congrats to Team Canada. You won it. You won the game. And you won the gold medal. And if you want to know what my reaction was like when Crosby scored that game winner, Think of this. Remember Big Vol Daddy's video of uh, him going crazy after after Terrence Cody blocked that field goal in Tennessee and Tennessee lost Alabama. That was me. That was exactly what I did. I could not control myself. I was pissed. And you know what? Same time though. I have a lot. We have a lot to be proud of. All American hockey fans have a lot to be proud of right now, first of all. To say that this team has been a shock is an understatement. This team played so well. At the onset, when I first saw this roster, when many first, first people, uh, people first saw this roster, th this team wasn't even expected to medal. I looked at my dad when I was watching the Winter Classic with him and we saw the uh, the unveiling of the U.S. roster. I looked at my dad and my dad looked at me and I said, this team is going nowhere. This team is going to suck. But I think all of us right now can eat our words. This team just took a very talented Canadian team to overtime and showed a lot of heart. And they have nothing to hang their heads about because they gave it all they had and they left it on the ice. And I couldn't be more proud to be a American hockey fan right now and to be an American hockey player right now. I've played the game all my life, and I'm proud of the talent that the United States puts out. And the future is bright for American hockey, as you saw in the World Juniors. That being said, however, congrats to Team Canada. You guys beat us. He should have beaten us by a lot more, but Ryan Miller, God, if you play like that when you get back to the NHL, the Buffalo Sabres, Sabres fans, you guys are going places with that team if Miller plays like that because he just played unbelievable. And if there is a U.S. MVP, it's Ryan Miller. This guy stood on his head every night and never let it a bad goal. You had to truly beat him in order to score. So, Ryan Miller, you have my congratulations and a lot of my respect. Okay? And also, I hate to say this, and Penguins fans and all Canadians will probably kill me for this, but of all people to score the game-winning goal, it had to be Sidney Crosby. It had to be Sidney Crosby. Of all people. It could have been anyone. It's Crosby. God. I hate you, Sidney. I freaking hate you. Whatever, though. I mean, I'm proud of the U.S. team. They showed a lot of heart. They showed a lot of desire. They showed a lot of want to. It's too bad we couldn't get it done. But it just goes to show you there's plenty of, of hockey talent in the United States. It's not all from Canada anymore. It comes from all over the world. But the United States, the future looks bright for hockey here. So that's it. That's my thoughts on the game. And the only the other thing I want to say is that had it not been for Ryan Miller, this game could have been over by the end of the second period. The U.S. team only started playing well on the time when they had to. And the Canadians kind of thoroughly dominated us. And it w if it wasn't for Ryan Miller, it would have been a slaughter. So it just came down to talent. And the goal that Crosby scored at the end was very lucky. And uh, just kind of handcuffed Miller. That's all I'm going to say. Lucky goal. Congrats, Canada, on your win. I expect all the nationalist comments on this video. And you know what? So be it.
You guys can tell me how it is. But I'll take it like a minute. Okay? That's it for now. This is Sun Scenario 6. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. USA Hockey, you have my respect, and my applause, and my salutes. You guys deserve it. Okay? Hold your heads high, America. That's it for me. Sun Scenario 6, out.